the top 10 richest presidents of the world. Welcome to the video, guys. Lucky are those who rule the whole country instead of a small company. But if these people also have huge fortunes with them, they are considered to be the luckiest in the world. Presidents of the country are often very rich due to the resources available to them and later the opportunities they have to grow their businesses. Today, let's take a look at 10 of the richest presidents in the world. Number 10. Sebastian Pinera, President of Chile Sebastian was a Chilean billionaire businessman who started ruling the country in 2018. He also served the country from 2010 to 2014. His father was a democratic politician and Christian diplomat. Sebastian studied at the Pontifical Catholic University of Chile for engineering business and economics at top-known university, Harvard. He was a visionary leader and an intelligent businessman. His net worth was estimated at $2.8 billion in 2019, considering him as one of the richest people alive in Chile. Apart from the fact that he has ruled a marvelous country, Panera is the owner of the local television channel Chile Vision, and maybe that helped him get elected in 2010, or maybe it was his spot at Chile's most famous football club, Colo Colo, that brought him in everyone's attention. His businesses and income sources also consist of the Allian Airline, as he owns 28% of Allian Airlines since 1994. Number 9. Muhammad VI Muhammad VI was the youngest child of Hassan II. When he was born, Muhammad had delegated heir apparent and crown prince. He was the elected president of the Pan-Arab Games and was authorized a colonel major of the Royal Moroccan Army as the ideal outline of the colloquialism, rich as a lord. His father died in 1999, so claiming two and a half billion dollars, the Lord of Morocco position as leader in 1999. Tragically, his family was not as supportive. The country was facing tons of issues as degradation, riots, and a lot of broken promises. Yet, even if he won't be king in the future, he will still be one of the richest people from Africa, since he is a major shareholder of the ONA Group, which activates in different areas such as mining and retail. Number 8. Islam Karimov Islam Karimov is the sole president of the Central Asian Republic of Uzbekistan, who has total assets of $1 billion. He was conceived on January 13, 1938 in Samarkand to a Tajik mother and Uzbek father. At first, he went to state-funded schools and afterward, he continued to the Central Asian Polytechnic College, procuring a certificate in engineering. Later on, he turned into the primary delegate executive of the state arranging office. Islam became Uzbek Soviet Socialist Republic's president in 1990 and after a year, pronounced the republic a free country. On the 29th of December 2009, the nation held the primary official political race where he won 86% of the votes. In 1995, he got an expansion of his term in office until 2000. He got reappointed to office in both the 2000 and 2007 decisions that again were considered subjective. He's been blamed for the autocracy and concealment of political resistance. Number 7. Melas Zanawi Melas Zanawi was an Ethiopian government official and finance manager who had a total net worth of $3 billion. Melas Zanawi is the previous prime minister of Ethiopia. A former executive of his local nation, Zanawi was president of Ethiopia in the 90s. Anyway, his administration went under genuine assault as he was blamed for mishandling a line of basic liberties issues and quelling the opportunity of press or discourse. He was 57 when he left. Number 6. Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani, Emir of Qatar Can you dare to even think that Qatar has no richest president? It is one of the wealthiest nations on the planet. Hamad's net worth of two and a half billion dollars. The Emir Hamad container Khalif Al Thani rules Qatar since 1995, when his dad kicked the bucket. However, his family's ancestry as pioneers goes far away in time. The Qatari government currently alludes to him as His Highness the Father Emir. Hamad held on to power in a bloodless royal residence overthrow in 1995. During his 18-year rule, Qatar's flammable gas creation arrived at 77 million tons, making Qatar the most extravagant nation on the planet per capita with the normal pay in the nation, US $86,440 every year 
per individual. Number 5. Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Emir of Dubai, $4 billion. Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum started to be the Emir of Dubai and be Prime Minister and Vice President of the United Arab Emirates in January 2006. Raised in a family of four sons, he inherited those positions from his brother, Maktoum bin Rashid Al Maktoum. Not only that, some of his wives come from royal families, but also four of his daughters married with other sheikhs, so his family's estimated worth is around $44 billion. He is the major shareholder of Dubai Holding, he has some of the biggest properties in the country and also owns the world's second largest yacht. Number 4. Kim Jong-un Kim Jong-un is the preeminent head of North Korea, who has a total net worth of $5 billion. Albeit less is thought about Kim Jong-un contrasted with other political pioneers the world over, he has in any case gotten extensive consideration from the media. Kim Jong-un holds numerous titles in North Korea, including Marshal and Chairman of the Central Military Commission, Chairman of the State of Affairs Commission, and in the General President. In North Korean media, he is known as Dear Leader. As the head of North Korea, Kim Jong-un has been at the cutting edge of innumerable debates because of supposed wrongdoing submitted by his country, for example, torment, kidnappings, internment in jail camps, and numerous others. He's the proprietor of numerous organizations like Siam Cement, the biggest modern aggregate of Thailand, and he has just about 3,493 sections of land off grounds in Bangkok. Number 3. Bumabal Adaladej Bumabal got the title King Bumabal the Great in 1987. He was the ninth ruler of Thailand from the Chakri administration, named Rama the Ninth. Thailand is not a dream place for vacationing, yet additionally it has perhaps the most elite and richest president on the planet. Bomabal Adiadej, the king of Thailand, has an expected net worth of $30 billion. He controls this nation since 1946 and is viewed as the world's longest serving current head of state and the most extravagant regal individual the longest prevailing ruler to have ruled distinctly as a grown-up, ruling for a very long time and 126 days. During his rule, he was served by a sum of 30 executives. Number 2. Hassanal Balkia 29th and current Sultan and Yang de Partian of Brunei, Hassanal Balkia just as the Prime Minister of Brunei, making him one of the last total rulers. The oldest child of Sultan Omar Ali Safiuddin III and Raja Isteri. The king has been positioned amongst the most wealthy people on the planet. After Queen Elizabeth II, the ruler is the world's second longest ruling current ruler. Brunei is as small as its sultan is rich. Hassan Al has a fortune of net worth around $20 billion and a lot of controversies around him. With such a worth, no wonder that he is the owner of one of the world's largest and most expensive car collections. He's divorced twice already and stripped his ex-wives of all their royal titles. His family includes seven daughters, five sons, and ten grandchildren. Number 1. Vladimir Putin The current president of Russia, Vladimir Putin, is the world's wealthiest president, having an expected fortune of more than $40 billion. Last year, Hermitage Capital Management CEO Bill Browder told the Senate Judiciary Committee that he believes the Russian president is the richest man in the world, with a net worth of $200 billion. Browder has some bona fides to back up his Russian connections. The financier's firm was once the largest portfolio investor in Russia. With many other properties, Vladimir Putin possesses 11 expensive yachts. We hope you guys found this video very enriching. If you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell icon.